Okay. We got Goose here. Goose, thanks for letting us record this. What'd you do? How'd you do this? I thought you were sharpening something. Well, I sharpened it and this was... I see. You, you had an extra sharp. <laughs> then I, I was cleaning I got them up. I got it. Okay, so wiggle your finger. So we always want to document that we have full range of uh, movement. Can you feel me touching down here? Yeah, and then if we press, we can see that we've got good capillary refill, so uh, our structures are intact. And so we soaked it in the Betadine solution here for a little while, and now we're just, uh, we're going to put some stitches in, okay? Okay. Are you ready? He's ready. Yeah. Genuine. Cleaned it up, you put some uh, something like bacitracin on it, right? Yes. Okay. And uh, have you gotten the uh, tetanus yet? Yes. Oh, good. It's been a while, hadn't it? Yes. You were kind of due there. All right, let's see if we can. There we go. Beautiful. Well, you know, it's really not that complex, Jenny. So these stitches are gonna to need to stay in about a week, okay? About seven days. And then we'll take them out, or if everything's looking good, you can take them out, as long as it's all properly healed. Oh, did you wanna cut, Jenny? Go ahead. Yes, sir, I you do, cut. I do. Good, good, okay. Four by four, please. Oh, I have them. Look at that, that's uh -huh. just, you know, the first stitch is critical. Right, Goose? He doesn't want to talk. We couldn't get him to shut up you earlier. Okay, now, honey? now you Are won't you talk. Are you with us? <laughs> what what pound test line is that? <laughs> uh, it's about uh, twenty. I have fifteen. Eight. I don't know. I don't know if we have a test, you know. Like so we want to get right there. Oh, stitch in. How's the anesthesia working for you? Not feeling the thing. Doing oh, great. Okay, that's it's good. It's the way we want it. That is what we want. That is true. You want to get big bites because we actually have a little bit of a flap right here, right? So the yes. the uh, the location of the stitch, right, it's kind of important so that we tack it down. Sometimes the very tip of the flap won't survive, but I think this one's got very good vascular supply, and we're going to be okay. I don't think you're going to lose a chunk of meat, so to speak. Or a chunk of skin. But it could happen. I, I still got nine more in case something goes wrong. Well, you do have extra. That's <laughs> right, Jenny. We do have extra. Okay. Look at that. Already looks a lot better, huh? Yes. Okay, let me get a couple more. And Jenny, you're crowding me just a little bit here. Well, I can't. You're making me nervous. You're making me nervous. Because I have to. You know, I like good. Video. Well, you know, can you, uh, you can come around behind I'll me over here, John. Yeah, John. Come around. Does he, if y'all see anything like that, that's what, it's his beautiful shirt. Oh, stop. Yeah. The director. Get one right here. And this one. Oh, yeah, I'll take that. Very good. Smooth, Jenny. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, we had to grab it, that one. What's for lunch today? Oh, catfish station, some fry fish. Fry Don't shrimp, take chicken fingers. <laughs> my, my, my favorite. Finger food? <laughs> Finger food. We have hush puppies or uh, cornbread? So, <laughs> Fries, Let's get this one right fries. here. Mm -hmm. okay. I'll tell you what, I'm kind of in the mood for okra. I don't know any okra mm. in You like okra, Jenny? I love, 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 love okra. Do you really? Did, they, did, have you, did you ever have uh, okra? Uh, okra? Hey, Y'all ever had okra before you come back here from Vietnam? We have eat a lot of okra in Vietnam. Really? I did yes. not know that. Okay. Well, it's very healthy. Oh, it is. I love it. Lightly fried, not over fried. Lightly. Right? We 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 steam it, and then we put uh, green onions with a little bit of uh, olive oil. 
Oh, really? On it, so yummy. Now, do you season that with something spicy? Just, just garlic salt. Oh, that's... I know you like spicy. If I, oh, yeah. if, I make, if I bring it in, I'll make it spicy. For Not you. too spicy. Not too spicy. I think we said five stitches, didn't we? Three Goose doesn't want to talk Three anymore. Six. Come on, Goose. We said five, right? We say five, <laughs> five or four? Five, five or six. Uh, yeah, we'll let's see. Okay. Yeah, let's get one right there. I just want to have enough stitch left over to do one more after this. We're going to give him a bonus stitch, Jenny. Yeah, bonus stitch. Yeah, he's being a good sport. Okay. Cut. Oopsie, sorry. Oh my goodness, I cannot see. There we go. Okay. When was the last time you had your eyes checked? Been a while? No, last year. But I, this is not a very good position. One more. Three, We're gonna get one more right here. There we go. There it is. I think that's all we're gonna need. That's really shallow right there. Are we seven or are we six? I think, it, I think it's uh, seven. That's a lucky number. Two, four, no, six. Yeah, six. But we only said five, so he still got the bonus. <laughs> nice round number, even number. Of even years. number. Well, actually, I prefer <laughs> odd numbers when it comes to sutures. All right, Jenny, one more cut, please, ma'am. One more cut. Okay, you know what? Actually, I did try to watch it. Try to cut it through the camera. No, sorry. I got the sharp over on the table. Jenny, will you dress one? this for Absolutely. us? Absolutely. Okay. Now, tomorrow... I want you to take a picture of this and send it to me over the portal. Okay. okay. And uh, that way we can do a little wound check, make sure everything looks good. But uh, I think that came together just fine. And uh, so in about a week, if you want to repeat the process, send me a picture. I'll let you know whether you can take the stitches out or not. And if we're not sure, well, we'll say come on by and we'll take a look at it for you. Okay. Okay. Well, what are limitations on moving my finger? I uh, stay away from really sharp steak knives. <laughs> Start there, of course. Uh, no, you can pretty much do what you want. I, I would stay out of the, the workshop and things like that. You know, but uh, no, you can do what you want to do. I assembled things for my job. Yeah. So I didn't know if that was... Yeah. You're not left-handed, right? No. Yeah. That's... There we go. Looks good. Thank you, All sir. All right. Good job, Goose. Thank you, everyone. Morning Rockstars, it's Rockstar Ben. So today I want to tell you about this really cool um, energy supplement that I came across. It's called Meta 7. Dr. John Gilmore is the creator. And basically, I'm always looking for the next best energy supplement to keep me going throughout my crazy day between two kids, a husband, four dogs, a job. and The list goes on and on, we all know. Um, so when I came across Meta 7 by Dr. John Gilmore, I really liked it because for a couple reasons. Um, it's a sustainable energy throughout my day. It's not like a hard, you know, chug Red Bull, get a nice pick me up and then crash super hard. It's not like that at all. Um, it lasts throughout the day, little, almost little spurts here and there. The only thing that was interesting for me, not even a, not even a bad thing, is that it took a couple weeks to really get in my system, I think, and start working on a regular basis where I fell out, wake up feeling rested, um, I wake up feeling like I can take on the day. And that's how I felt today. So I definitely just want to share, because I know there's a lot of you guys out there who have the same everyday struggles in life uh, to keep it going as I do, and this definitely helps. So if you want to give it a whirl, Click on the description below and the link and um, get you some. So next time, guys.